This type of person will do well with an online art therapy business. So I'm going to explain some of the characteristics of this person, this type of person who will do really well with an art therapy business. So someone who is more suited for a business, suited more for self-employment and doing more online work as well. So if you are like this, then the online RTP business path is really for you and it's great for you and you will most likely be successful with it. So this person, first of all, is freedom loving. Uh, it's going to be someone who doesn't like to do the same thing over and over and over again and just be doing the same thing constantly, right? This person loves to be creative, loves that freedom to create and express. Um, so that freedom is very important for that person. The second thing is that person loves and needs flexible time in their life, in their, in their day to day. Whether it's because that's their preference or whether it's because um, of a certain circumstances like their physical health, you know, or they have other family responsibilities that take away certain times of the day um and make them unavailable for work right it doesn't matter but it's just that they need flexible time so if you are a person who needs flexible time or who prefers flexible time then online rtp business is really for you the third characteristic is that this person is a self-starter so this person is really motivated in creating their own thing in doing their own thing in being independent in being unique and really paving a new path for themselves instead of following someone else's path or someone else's structure um, and things like that the other thing about this person is that this person is really an original thinker um, they love uh, being a creator themselves, right? Um, and just creating their own structure too, right? So not just creating something creative, but really having their own kind of original structure, original idea, and they love doing that. And the other thing about this person who will do well with online art therapy business is that they love sharing about art therapy. They love connecting with people. They love talking about art therapy or art facilitation, whatever it is. Um, they love just sharing their ideas, sharing their thoughts and feelings, and really connecting with people through that their expressions, right? And the last thing is that this person really loves uh, to step into a bigger role they are ready for it they want to step into a bigger role as an art therapist or a facilitator they want to earn more right they want to impact more people they want to help more people they want to break the income ceiling or they want to break the limitations that maybe a lot of art therapists and art facilitators are experiencing and they want to really do something meaningful and big and um, something that creates impact in this world in a positive way, uh, in a unique way, in a really meaningful way. So those are the characteristics of a person who will do well with online art therapy business. Let me know if that resonated with you. If you are also freedom loving, need flexible time, you're a self-starter, you want to be original, you love sharing about art therapy, and you want to really step into a bigger role, let me know because you are up in my alley. I am this type of person and I find that online art therapy business is perfect for this um, a person who has these characteristics. So thanks for being here with me. I'll talk to you in the next episode or video all about more tips about RTB business.